Well, as you know, there has never been a referendum debate in which the Taoiseach has taken part, and that is for a very good reason. This isn't a personality contest. This is an issue where the citizens need to make a choice about proposals for constitutional reform that are put before them. We pledged, as part of our five-point plan on which uh, all of Fine Gael, uh, stood, indeed the Labour Party, Sinn Féin, and at that time Fianna Fáil also pledged that they would put this proposal to the people, and we are delivering on that pledge, uh, and that's the way that this has been conducted. As Director of Elections, are you taking part in the debate, or is anyone from Fine Gael? I think obviously we have to wait and see what format uh, is decided for that debate. Uh, we will debate, and the yes side will debate. There's many strands to the yes uh, campaign. The yes side will debate at any forum that is established. Have you been asked to by your team? No, I haven't been personally asked. But we, you know, that's still a number of days away. I think what we're determined to do is make sure that in the remaining days, information is got out to people because I think the facts are compelling in this case. Uh, and I think that's the importance of what a constitutional uh, referendum campaign about. It is about informing people, not some phony, uh, you know, contests that you know a particular leader wants to create. That's that's not what this is about. Minister, there seems to be a high level of undecided even at this stage of the campaign. Is that something that worries you? We're only a couple of days out from polling day. I think significantly in today's poll, only 10% of people are indicating they would not vote. So that is a much higher level of engagement than I think a lot of people uh, expected. Uh, clearly, people are taking this seriously. It's uh, a big decision. Uh, but I'm encouraged by the fact that, you know, of those who have decided there's a majority of two to one in favour, I think that does signify that the information that people are receiving is uh, influencing them. But, you know, I recognise that there's no complacency can be had in any referendum. There's a lot of people still to make up their mind and we'll be out there trying to influence those decisions.